ADS-B uses GPS technology that is far more accurate and reliable than the radar dishes air traffic controllers currently rely on. So under the ADS-B mandate, most aircraft will need a way to calculate their precise position using GPS. This information is transmitted to ADS-B ground stations, which allows ATC to reduce separation minimums. To ensure safety, GPS data each plane sends must come from a highly accurate source, like an approved WAS GPS receiver. Approved WAS position sources are built into a wide range of new avionics, like the GTN 750 and the 650 series. For the immediate future, certain older navigators, like the popular non-WAS Garmin 430 and 530 series, can also be upgraded with a compliant WAS position source. Adding or upgrading with a WASP position source can provide your aircraft with some new capabilities as well, like the ability to fly GPS-guided LPV glide path instrument approaches down to as low as 200 feet. In the event that your operations don't require the benefits of WASP GPS navigation, there are ADSB solutions available with an optional built-in WASP position source, like our GDL88 data link. Using it as your ADSB solution might mean you don't have to install any additional equipment. You can choose the WAS option that fits your needs. If you fly below 18,000 feet and only within the US, you can use your existing WAS enabled GTN or GNS series, upgrade your non WAS GNS navigator, or get a GDL 88 with WAS capability. If you fly above 18,000 feet or outside of the US, your options are either the GTN series or the WAS-enabled GNS series navigator.